If you are a newbie to the tech world, love using internet and would like to stay safe while doing so, you must know what a VPN is and why you might need it. But let's not rush things. First things first, what is a VPN? VPN, a virtual private network, is a software that changes your IP address and encrypts all of your internet traffic. This improves online privacy security and helps users to bypass online censorship imposed by the government, ICPs, or any other organization or person blocking websites. The internet is not safe by default. Hackers are always looking for ways to get into your system and steal your money. This is in addition to governments spying on their citizens and ICPs, or internet service providers, selling your browsing data to marketers. When you turn on a VPN, virtual private network, on your computer, smartphone or tablet, it protects your data by putting everything you do online through a tunnel. And when you do things online using a VPN tunnel, nobody can see what you're doing, which gives you an extra layer of security. A VPN tunnel enhances your privacy by encrypting data, in other words, converting it into a code and making it unreadable for snoopers. Now let's talk about the benefits of using a VPN. And before we do that, smash the like button if you like the video so far, I'd appreciate that, and let's proceed. Using a VPN service will give its users, and you potentially, several vital benefits, and these are as follows. VPN prevents your internet provider, ICP, from seeing what you do on the internet. In addition to this, websites cannot see either your real IP address or who your ICP is, all they can see is the IP address of the VPN server, which is usually shared among many VPN users to further protect each individual. Unlike ICPs, though, reputable VPN providers do not store your personal data and your logs for further retrieval. Indeed, good VPN providers go even a step further and delete all metadata connection logs, which might be indirectly linking customers to their activity on the internet. The next benefit VPNs provide is that they defeat censorship. By connecting to a VPN, you can access blocked websites. Simply connecting to a VPN server located somewhere where these websites are not censored. The next benefit is that a VPN allows you to access streaming services such as Netflix. For example, by connecting to a VPN server somewhere in the United States, you can get an access to the Netflix libraries for US citizens only. The American version of this service has more TV shows and movies than any other country's Netflix catalog. Or if you connect to a VPN server located somewhere in the United Kingdom, you can watch BBC iPlayer for free from abroad. The the next benefit a VPN provides is that it protects you from hackers. Now, how do you know that a public Wi-Fi in your favorite local coffee shop is safe? The answer is you don't. This goes for free public Wi-Fi's everywhere. You don't know who might be using this same public Wi-Fi, so better don't take any chances. Using a VPN will protect you because your data is securely encrypted. The next benefit a VPN provides is that it protects you when P2P torrenting. When you use a VPN for torrenting, your real IP address is shielded from peers downloading the same torrents. It also hides the content of what you download from your ICP and is handy for accessing blocked websites. Now tell me which of these benefits appeal to you the most. Would you rather use VPN to access Netflix libraries from another country or would you rather stay safe online while using public Wi-Fi? So what would be your primary goal of using a VPN? Let me know in the comments. I would really love to learn your opinion. So you might be wondering with all these benefits, are VPNs legal? Well, VPNs are legal in most countries. However, there are countries where VPN services are either restricted or severely regulated, such as China, Iran, Russia, and some other countries. You might want to check them out before you go traveling, and you can find the list on the web. Now, some FAQs you might also be interested in include Will VPN slow down my internet connection? Well, a VPN app routes your data to a VPN server, which then spans processing power to 
encrypt or decrypt your data before processing it and sending it further. So it's inevitable that it will slow down your internet connection at least a little bit. The two biggest factors of how much the speed will be decreased is where that VPN server is located and how loaded it is. If you connect to a VPN server that is located somewhere near to yourself and that is not overloaded, you will lose a maximum of 10% of your internet speed. However, the best and the fastest VPN providers invest heavily in high-speed servers, so you won't have to deal with slow internet connection. The next commonly asked question is that can I use the same VPN on all of my devices? Don't be greedy. The short answer is yes. Every VPN provider allows you to install its software on as many devices as you want. However, some VPN providers limit the number of devices that you connect to the same account on VPN. The next commonly asked question is, can I get a free VPN? Don't be embarrassed, we all like free stuff, eh? And the short answer is yes, but. There are now at least a couple of free VPN services that are actually quite good. However, they are limited in their features compared to premium VPNs. The next very important question is, does a VPN make me safe? And the short answer is yes, and now the long answer. A VPN will make you safe from public Wi-Fi hackers, your ICP, mass government surveillance, commercial Wi-Fi operators who sell your browsing habits for profit, copyright holders, advertising and analytics companies who store your data to target you with ads and so on. If all of this sounds like something you could make a good use of, make sure to go and check out some of the trusted VPN providers I have found on the web. Best speed, best lock policy, best performance and extremely user-friendly. So even if you are a newbie in using a VPN, you will have no issues using it. Now let me know in the comments if you have any questions related to how to use a VPN. Stay tuned for more hacks on internet security and keep yourself safe online. See you soon. Bye.